Hello guys, welcome to Take Me Devoted. In this video, we will learn how to implement linear search in Java. Linear search or sequential search is a method for finding a particular value that consists of checking every one of its element one at a time and in sequence until the desired one is found. It is the simplest search algorithm. For n items, the best case is when the value is equal to the first element of the list, in which case only one comparison is needed. The worst case is when the value is not in the list or occurs only once at the end of the list, in which case n comparison are needed. Linear searches don't require the collection or array to be sorted. So let's start coding and let's learn how to implement linear search in Java. So guys here I have created one class linear search and let's start coding. So first we need to take input from user. In this case we will take uh, three input from user. First is size of the array then numbers whatever the numbers uh, they want to provide and uh, third one the key uh, in that num numbers uh, which he want to search so so what will we do we will first write this scanner class okay then uh, we will ask user to provide how many number you want to enter okay now so this will be the size actually size of the array as we are taking array here so size of the array so what we will do dot next int okay now now what we will take we will take one array int array okay and take some search array okay the new int will provide the size here so user has provided size and it is stored in this variable so this will be the size of the array okay now now it's done then then user needs to provide the numbers of particular size suppose size is 10 then user need to provide 10 numbers okay so what we will do here we'll write this out and ask enter numbers suppose there uh, if user provide 10 then it it will ask enter 10 numbers now we have to write these things here okay so what we'll do because we have 10 numbers it's better to take a loop less than size now we will store here uh, we will uh, store in a uh, array this array okay so okay so in this way we will uh, ask user to provide the numbers and we will store all those numbers in this array now now we need uh, user need to provide what key uh, he needs uh, he want to search from that array okay so we will write one print statement and asking user that enter enter number you want to search okay now we will 
again capture it int let's take one value like search value is equal to what input dot next int <laughs> done now now we'll close this input okay <coughs> now this is done now now what we will do we will have to write one method uh, for linear search so let's declare one method here then we will call from this man method so let's the method name will be public static it will return int linear search it will take two argument one will be the this array and another uh, well argument will be the search value so let's here write one int array this the name will be a and some key value whatever you want to search that search value will be stored in this key okay then now it will ask return statement okay now as we know what is linear search we will go from index to index and we will search that key whether it is available or not if it is available then it will return the index of that key okay so we will write one for loop for int uh, is equal to 0 then i is less than this one this array name a dot is length okay then i will increment this okay now now we will search whether this is present or not if a of i is equal to this key whatever the search value we stored in this key will search whether this is present in this array or not okay then what we will return we will return index of key so if it will be true then i will be the index return i else else we will return anything return minus one for not found okay that's it so this is the only code for linear search okay it's so simple now we have to just call this function okay so let's store this uh, value let's store this uh, whatever the is will be returned let's store in one value let's take int uh, take index okay index is equal to we will call this function here okay it will return int value so this value will be we will store in index okay and we will pass here uh, first is this array okay and second is our search value whatever user want to search okay that's it now now if this index our index see this value it will search this code will search and return the index of that key so if that index is not equal to minus one okay if it will be minus one then what we will uh, it will be minus one then it is not found in that area so we will check whether it is minus one or not if not is minus one then what we will do we will write the print statement and uh, we'll write this search value okay then a is found at position what position index okay this index okay now else 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 we will write that this is out uh, 
the same thing search value is not available okay it's not found okay so that's it this is the code so what we have done we'll ask user to enter the size uh, how many numbers he, uh, he wants to enter so we will store this in size then this size will be the size of the our search array then we will ask user to enter the numbers of that particular size and then we will uh, store uh, those numbers in our array then we will ask what number uh, user want to search then we will store this is in search value then we will call the function linear search linear search we will calculate the whether the, we will pass this thing search array and search value so a will be the search array and key will be the search value then we will check whether in this array it is present or not if it is present we will return the index of that else minus one so let's run this so how many numbers you want to enter so suppose i want to enter 10 numbers okay now enter 10 numbers we have to enter 10 numbers so i already told you that it uh, it is not necessary it should be shorted or not it doesn't matter so let's enter 10 number okay so let's 23 12 21 34 so we have entered these 10 values okay now enter number you want to search suppose i want to search 91 okay so i will enter 91 so 91 is found at position 7 so if we see here 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so it will search linearly and we will get the value run one more time and suppose uh, how many uh, number you want to enter suppose i enter 5 then i will enter 5 num oh sorry enter Five number now enter number you want to search suppose I'll give some 90 which is not present in that area so 90 not found because 90 is not present in this area so in this way we are able to implement linear search in Java uh, guys we can implement this if you will use collection then we can we have directly uh, we can use directly method of that uh, linear search is a method there but uh, we will discuss this while uh, uh, while we will <coughs> uh, see the collections video but this is the basic thing and we should uh, I always focus on the basic thing this should know we should know we can implement methods anyway but this is the basic thing we should always know okay hope this is helpful thanks for watching